peace out at the swan. Go kilowatts on back. Right, so I've got a little update. Um, as I'm on my way to the Immortals gym, the box class tonight. Um, it's biked all the way. It's like two and a half miles to the class and two and a half miles back. But more importantly, everyone, I woke up this morning. Uh, I, unfortunately, I had a message of someone saying something about Ben Hatchett and a hospital. Uh, so I messaged Ben. And I said, is the fight still on? And he said, he don't know. Now, for the last week, week and a half, Ben's been uh, reaching out to me every day, it seems, trying to get into my head because the way I see it, guys, this fight is getting smoked. He's getting absolutely smoked. Um, he knows it and I know it and everyone else knows it. He's run out of time on this camp. He started too late, and I'm getting I'm getting trained by the best. So, either because there's no proof of this hospital thing, and I, and and a part of me is thinking, oh, I hope he's all right. I hope nothing's happened to his family and stuff like that, you know. But um, if no proof comes or anything like that soon, obviously then he's just trying to get in my head. But even if even if Ben Hatchett's not my opponent and he wants to go and fight some fucking Ed Matthews in a back garden instead of fighting on one of the best promotions in Britain, without a doubt, bad to the bone, in a rematch, then so be it, guys. But this is the real fight right here. I'm getting trained at the Immortals, putting in all the graft, all the hard work. My dedication uh, is, is going to pay off, guys. The preparation I'm putting in every single day, the hard work, the effort, the correct training, the right stuff, Right food, sleeping, no bloody, no alcohol, not a drop, not one drop in this camp. Hatchet, if you pull out, yeah, and don't show any proof of no hospitals and go and fight Ed Matthews in a back garden, you are the biggest shitbag ever and you are then the embarrassment to bare knuckle. Because you called me an embarrassment to bare knuckle. To go and fight in a back garden against Ed Matthews in a back garden fight instead of fighting on a bare knuckle promotion, you're the embarrassment. So everyone, guys, I've got to um, continue my bike ride and uh, peace out. This one, go kilowatts and back. 
on the way back home now. This is a message for Ben Hatchet. Ben Noble's Hatchet. So, myself and Mike at the Mortals, we want to know what's going on. Is you, are, you, are you in hospital because your teeth fell out as well as your ass? Oh, so it's just head games, whatever, but you are a disgrace to Bear Nickel if you don't fight me on the 11th of November and then fight Ed Matthews in a back garden. All right? I've put in so much hard work. It doesn't matter who my opponent is. Come the 11th of November, Charlie Bronson title's mine. You can watch on on the sidelines if you want. But either way, the Swan's going to be victorious. You will not get out the first round with the Swan. Not after this camp. No way. Trust me, people. I bet you I don't get to showcase everything I've been working on. Anyway, at the Swan.